That looked quite easy. Yeah. Just One, going two, back and three, forth. Four, five, okay, six. so I mean, we're gonna yeah. have. Uh, oh, is it five, six, seven? We're gonna have TCT join us uh, later on. Maybe he's gonna teach us a, some moves, some a salsa thing moves. Thing or two, maybe, yeah. maybe. All right. MM is standing by now. And of course, he's gonna be taking us through the movies showing this weekend at the cinemas. I'm Hi, Thank MM. you, Yummy. Oh, it's fun. Friday, yay! And along salsa. Another fun activity you should do is go to the cinema. It actually means, you know, catching a movie, unwinding, relaxing. And we have a lineup of movies showing at the cinema you should see. Kidnap is an American action thriller movie directed by Louis Prato and written by Nate Jolteny. The film stars Harley Berry, Leo Temple, Sage Courier, and Chris Mutkin. It tells a story about a mother who tries to rescue her abducted son from dangerous kidnappers. This is one movie you should watch, especially if you're a Halle Berry fan. The movie Step documents the senior year of a girls' high school step dance team against the background of inner city Baltimore. Directed by Amanda Lupitz, the movie cast include Paula Duffett, Blessing Giraldo, Corey Granger, and others. Yeah. If you're a lover of dance, then you should definitely watch this. Another movie showing in the cinema this weekend it's, is The Dark Tar. It's an American science fiction Western film directed and co-written by Nicolaj Assel. A continuation of Stephen King's novel series of the same name, the films of the same name. The film stars Idris Elba and on a, quest to, on a quest to protect the doctor, a mythical structure which supports all realities, and Matthew McConaughey as his nemesis. All right, another movie that will be showing in the cinema this weekend is Hakunde, finally, a Nollywood movie that is filled with comedy and drama. Starring Tony Abraham, Shay Lo, Ali Nuhu, and a cast of others, the movie tells an intriguing story of a young graduate who battles through everything on his journey to self-discovery and actualization. Right. If you love a feel-good movie, then you need to watch Girls Trip. I have seen this movie and I love it. It's a 2017 American comedy film directed by Malcolm D. Lee. The film stars Regina Hall, Queen Latifah, Tiffany Haddish, Jada Pinkett Smith, Lawrence Tate, and Mike Coulter. It follows a group of four friends who go to New Orleans to attend the Essence Music Festival in order to reconnect. It has received, the movie has received positive reviews from critics and has grossed $72 million worldwide. Wow, that's quite um, impressive. And that's all on, those are a few of the movies that I'll be showing at the cinema. Moving on to Yomi and Titi. All right, so um, Titi, are you going to be checking out uh, any films I this weekend? I have a feeling I have to check out what's happening in the cinema myself. Yeah, the girls' trip, there. perhaps. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Or you're going to call me chauvinist again for, for, for well, going in that direction. Well, funny enough, we women do watch action films too, so hello. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, <coughs> well, we have um, Off Young Anthony Edit joining us on the couch. Uh, he's popularly known as Thin Tall Tony. Mm -hmm. now, apart from seeing him perform earlier, a lot of you might not know that he is a professional artist who has continued to rule the dance industry and his great command of and mastery of the arts. Now, mm -hmm. he was brought, that was brought to the limelight by uh, a popular reality show, Big Brother Nigeria. Now, in 2005, he was awarded the UNESCO Dance Web Scholarship for five weeks training at the Impulse Stands uh, in Vienna, Austria. Well, that's... Uh, that's really big. Pretty mm. big. That's big. That's, that's pretty big. <laughs> that's now, let's see uh, a, a recent video that he had. Um, mm. uh, let's check it out right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, you know what? Before the video, yeah. let's talk TTT. All right. Who is... Thin, tall, Tony. Who has suddenly become a trend. Because <laughs> yeah, everybody so now knows you. I, I, mean, I mean, you were popular before now yeah. in some circles. But suddenly, um, after the show, yeah. you're right. all over the place. Well, exactly. people, people know people, people on the screen, but then do they really know you? Who is Tony? Uh, well, yeah. Tony is a very simple guy. Uh, um, everything ar around me is rather has involved around creativity. 
Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm that guy that takes out nothing and makes it something. Mm. Uh, I like to make things happen. Okay. Whenever I, I love a dull moment, just oh. to change it and then still be relevant. Wow. Yes. Okay. There's quite a lot that um, you, you are known predominantly for dance. I mean, you've yeah. also done a little bit of modeling and a couple of other things. Yeah. But I'm sure that you, there's a number of things that you have also gotten involved in over mm. the last um, few months, yes. including movies mm -hmm. and some upcoming projects. Yes. You want to talk about those? Okay, uh, for, for movies, I was opportunity to meet the amazing Jackie Appia. Oh my God. So mm -hmm. I, 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 I worked with her on a film, cinema movie coming out, uh, it's called Celebrity Marriage. Okay. And then um, right now I'm working towards my dance concert on the okay. 8th of October. Okay. Still talking to Echo Hotels because mm. it's going to be massive. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, um, I have like a, sh a few projects here and there with a carnival in Calabar as well uh, to look forward to. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I'm, I'm really open to uh, a whole lot of things, things that I wanted to do because I don't want to limit myself just like the dancer. You know, there's a whole lot that we can do. At some point as a creative person, when they came to the theater to look for maybe a scriptwriter or a research person, mm -hmm. because you're a dancer, so they don't come to you. So oh. I had to... I had to break the norm, I had to go out of that, I had to learn how to do every other thing, acting, music, composition, writing, uh, be a stage manager, and I, did it, I didn't do it part-time, I did it full-time, mm. and I had time to do like 10 things at the same time. Mm. So if you call me to do or to be that guy for you, I think yeah. that's, very, right. very, that's very instructive that, you know, you would put yourself forward like that exactly. and not be known just for one thing, mm. but for uh, several things in yeah. the area of Speaking of things you've just been known for, one thing, to do as, at, as at right now, the most, um, I won't say relevant, you know, the, the most uh, that people have been talking about is the, the Big Brother competition. Yes. Um, now, the fact that you had to leave the house before winning, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> let's put it that way. That was, that was smooth, right? Yeah, that was, that was, that was, that was quick. Yeah. <laughs> that was quick. Um, was also, uh, you know, a really huge controversy. So I know that some people have seen you for the first time since Big Brother. I'm sure. Yeah. On TV. So there has to be a few messages you want to tell them about what happened in the house. Uh, in the house I came and I, I lived life to the fullest. Um, I try as much as I can to listen to the instructions from Mabel Carr, you know. Uh, we might look like we're friends, but we're not friends. Wow. So we have a game that we're playing. Okay. And um, <clears throat> in 100% of what the whole house is, you have mm -hmm. to also look for where your strongest point lies. Okay. So that people get to remember you for. Mm -hmm. I came into the house with the knowledge that I was already a winner. Okay. Because I think we're about 6,000 plus that came for the audition. So you being among the 16 yeah. select, that's a huge achievement, you know. Yeah. So I stayed eight weeks in the house. I guess it was that relevant. Mm. I guess so. Okay, Very eight nice. weeks out of how many weeks was the Eleven. whole? 11. 11 weeks. So oh, I mean, wow. you, were, you were almost at the final. I mean, exactly. you're top four. Yeah. Uh, no, not, not top four, but <laughs> top. Well, I have to say <laughs> that there's, there's still so much more to thin, tall, Tony. Yes. We have a, a short clip for you to watch. All right. And we'll be back.
we're still with the one and only TTT mm -hmm. in the house this morning. And Bad uh, boy, <laughs> <laughs> I had to take it there. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so TTT, uh, yeah. let's talk family. All right. Um, you're uh, you're doing so much, and then you still have time for family. Mm. Can you tell us about your family and your relationship with them? Um, my relationship with my family is one of a kind. Um, everyone is more like on their own, but we are also together. Okay. Um, I remember walking into the house after I got evicted, and my daughter saw me, she'd be like, Tim Tartoni. I'm like, <laughs> okay. Daughter? Yes. <laughs> you like, Tim Tartoni. <laughs> but she came and she hugged me. Yeah. You know, like, but it, took, it took her like about two weeks. Wow. Because she's now started calling me daddy. Oh, you wow. Know? But it oh, was, wow. it was, <laughs> but but the relationship is 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 there. Um, you know, there were some that we we we, we as a family we, we definitely have our ups and downs. There mm -hmm. are moments that we you know we had to let it out, shout and stuff. But we myself and my wife, I really adore my wife. Mm -hmm. We try as much as possible not to show any of that in front of the kids. Yeah. Okay. You know, um, you know we put a lot of things in for in front, mm -hmm. and she's one person that I respect that uh, respects a lot because she she's a chef just like. Beyonce. Famous Beyonce, <laughs> but she, she trained in Malaysia okay. and for her to come back and we have a family and she had to, you know, stop all of that so we can raise a family and then she will definitely go back. Mm. It's an amazing thing. Okay, so we're going to go to the kitchen soon, then, then. but I have to say it, people out there would probably crucify me if I didn't. Please. You know, hey, the, the fact that you did say that you were unmarried in the house was a big deal. You know, <laughs> what was your wife's reaction when you came out? Um, I never said I was unmarried. Really? I never said that. You sure about that? Very sure. Okay. What I said was when, when, when I was asked uh, something about marriage, I said, by the grace of God, it, in, in a theatrical term, it doesn't mean yes. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't mean no. Okay. okay. So I never All said right. I was unmarried. I never said anything. I just, I just, you know, when I went for the audition, I went as Tento Tony. I did not go there as Mr. Ophion. Right. All right. But, you know, yeah. we're very emotional like that. We get very attached mm -hmm. to things. So. No, but yeah. you did say that it was... Um, a kind of agreement that you, you oh, yes. had with your wife you know, before like going when in. when i told my wife she said yeah she all she actually told me in the beginning don't go you know wow. and then later on the 27th when i woke up in the morning she go like go now before you send a miss boy or future <laughs> you know so I, I think i think i was part of people that actually got to the auditions late yeah. on the 27th oh, so wow. um did and she now said you know she was always telling me things like okay so when they finally pick you now, that's how you're going to go. You finish one project, you're going to go another one. Then you're going to go for like three months. Now I'm going to see you again. Wow. Then you're going to come back and it's much limelight. You won't have time for us. You know, and I'm like, okay. she'd be I for not go before. <laughs> you know? So, but after, after, after all of that, you know, we, 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 we've been able to, yes, there, there, there's some point, you know, uh, when I was in the house and some information was going mm. on. Point she didn't watch the show. Uh. Her other sister did. So each time I was up for eviction, like, eh, you don't deal, oh yeah. Use the phone, put him up, and vote. And that's the only thing she did. Mm. All right, I have to go check out Meyonce in the kitchen before he burns all the food. Yeah. Um, but <laughs> did you say boy? Yes, I did. I did. Uh, I said burns all the food. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> did you just say boy? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, no. I'm shocked and disappointed. Uh, I'm heartbroken. No, no. I feel some kind of way right now. You know, <laughs> all sorts of way. <laughs> but I can see that you, you all this knife. Right. Really? I never said that. You sure about that? Very sure. Okay. What I said was when, when, when I was asked uh, something about marriage, I said, by the grace of God, it, in, in a theatrical term, it doesn't mean yes. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't, uh, mean, it doesn't mean no. Okay. So I never All said right. I was unmarried. I never said anything. I just, I just, you know, when I went for the audition, I went as Tento Tony. I did not go there as Mr. Ophion. Right. All right. But, you know, yeah. we're very emotional like that. We get very attached mm -hmm. to things. So. No, but yeah. you did say that it was... Um, a kind of agreement that you, you oh, yes. had with your wife you know, before like going when, in? When I told my wife, she said, yeah, she, all, she actually told me in the beginning, don't go, you know? Wow. And then later on the 27th, when I woke up in the morning, she go like, go now before you send a miss boy or future, <laughs> you know? So I, I, think, I think I was part of people that actually got to the auditions late yeah. on the 27th. Oh, wow. So, um, did, and she now said, you know, she was always telling me things like, okay, so... When they finally pick you now, that's how you're going to go. You finish one project, you're going to go another one. Then you're going to go like three months. Now I'm going to see you again. Wow. Then you're going to come back and it's much limelight. You won't have time for us. You know, and I'm like, 
Okay. She, I, she be I for not go before. <laughs> you know? So, but after 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 all of that, you know, we 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 we've been able to yes. That there, there's some point, you know, uh, when I was in the house and some information was going. Mm. On. Funny, she didn't watch the show. Uh. Her other sister did. So each time I was up for eviction, like, eh, you don't deal. Yeah, use the phone, put him up, and vote. And that's the only thing she did. Mm. All right, I have to go check out Meyonce in the kitchen before he burns all the food. Yeah. Um, but <laughs> did you say but? Yes, I did. I did. Uh, I said burns all the food. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> did you just say but? Eh? <laughs> uh, no, no. I'm shocked and disappointed. Uh, I'm heartbroken. No, no. I feel some kind of way right now. You know, <laughs> all sorts of way. <laughs> but I can see that you, you all these knife skills I taught you. <laughs> uh, are showing. You, you, you know. taught me again. <laughs> <laughs> you see, nice one. Today. So the green pepper. You try, you try. The green pepper. So um, right now, um, the shrimps, the steak, yeah. the green peppers, the carrots, um, everything is right here right now. Okay. Everything is cooking together, and what we need to do le uh, only is just to toss the pasta in, and okay. voila, we are good. But is, how long are these peppers going to cook for? Uh, they don't need to cook for that long. 30 seconds, you know, it's But fine. you know, some people want it to cook very well. No, no, no. It, it, that's a bit... It, 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 you, you don't need it too soggy, you know. We want mm. it a little bit crunchy, you know. Okay, so I can see that, you, as promised, the beef looks yes. very nice and brown. Yeah, you could and taste it. And it looks it, you know. well, well cooked. I can taste it? Yes. Really? Seriously? Yeah. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Now that just happened. <laughs> that what? just happened. You know. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> you tasted it in your dreams. One meal. <laughs> I thought you said I wanted to bomb food. One meal. <laughs> yes. You I was already <laughs> tripping like, oh my goodness. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So, um, so it's very simple, this process. Yes. You're just mixing everything in the wok. Yes. There's I'll, nothing else I'm supposed to do. Yeah. And one important thing to do while cooking pasta is leave little bit of pasta water because you might just need it for the gloss the final gloss which one is the gloss again you've come over. <laughs> which one is the gloss wow this pasta is it's what much it's much it's yeah. a bit too much do you mm. need some help with that you know i don't can worry, assist you you know i'm here no, don't worry don't worry no, yeah. I, after you said i'll bo hey i've taken it personal yeah. okay okay oh no you don't know how sure. personal i've taken it i could assist you, you know, <laughs> no no you need help just ask no, i'm right no. here yeah. So we really do not need the pasta water because it's still looking good. Everything okay. is still looking. Okay. But just in case, um, when, while you're cooking pasta uh, and you're not sure if um, it's looking good, just okay. reserve a little bit of pasta water so you can just sprinkle a little bit of it. Mm. It's very important. We, All right, then. You know, when cooking pasta, pasta water is really, really mm. important. I think maybe you need a stronger spoon there. Yep. Let me see if I can no, use this one would. for you. Let me, let me, let me, yeah. We'll use the two. Yeah, use the two. Yeah, yeah I got you. Yeah. Here yeah. you go. Aha. You see why you need me in your life? Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> um, um, your husband is going to call me after this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I would have eaten the food, so. He's going to ask me, um, uh, what was that all about? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but, um. What, what I can see here is that it, it seems to all be coming together, but it's not frying. No, we, you don't need it to fry. You've, because, like, I saw you put is, oil in it before. Yeah, everything, whatever you wanted to saute, is, um, you've done that with the beef and okay. the shrimps and okay. the peppers, you know. Okay. What you need to do is just to mix it together, you know. Okay, okay, all right, all right. So, um, yes, we start for, by cooking the pasta. Mm -hmm. well, when your pasta is done, reserve it. Okay. Um, your onions, garlic, mm -hmm. um, your steak. green peppers. Yeah, your, 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 your steak goes in, your beef fillet. Okay. You cut into pieces. All right. It goes in and um, you add your shrimps to it, your okay. tomatoes, your peppers. Okay. And voila, you know, you have a wonderful bowl of pasta. All Wait. right. So now, we say you should come and cook breakfast. Yeah. Is this one breakfast? <laughs> well, <laughs> you know, uh, <laughs> I just thought about it like, you know, pasta is, I, I love pasta. Pasta is my favorite dish. And I was like, you know, I just, I just want to give the people something, something to look at, you know. And <laughs> okay. no, but pasta is not breakfast, but you could have this for lunch. Really? And dinner. Okay. So I, I um, used style to taste it just now. <laughs> um, and it's not bad. <laughs> So for those of you who are cooking at home right now, you need your beef fillet, your yeah, shrimps, shrimps your bell peppers, bell peppers onions, tomatoes, garlic. onions, garlic, onions, um, 
Oliver, black pepper. <laughs> black pepper. Black pepper. So, yeeah. Yomi, I know that, you know, this is the kind of food you like. Yomi has yeah, of course. I mean, it's this. looking good. And the peppers, uh, the peppers are looking very uh, enticing this morning. Now, we're going straight to our performance by our star this morning, Nikki Laoye. And she'll be doing uh, some soulful jazz for us this morning. Good morning, everyone. Wake up, Nigeria. It's Nikki Laoye and Nelson on the guitar. And of course, today is a very special day. I say, of course, I celebrate my daddy today. And my little niece, Ire, happy birthday. And of course, to everyone out there, God loves you, because only him can give you beauty for ashes. Hey, no one else, only you, gives me beauty for ashes. No one else, only you, sets my
beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Nikki Laoye. Amazing, amazing. So <clears throat> we're still in the kitchen. Yeah. And Beyonce is forming activity. Like there's still so much more to do, but food is ready. <laughs> I have <laughs> been waiting for this. Tony, are uh, you, you interested in, you know, having some of this? It's Tony, yeah, let's so go. I'm not inviting your me. It's Tony I'm inviting. Why are you standing up? I always say yes to food. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh my. This whole thing was Nikki, made just for me. Please join <laughs> this us. This morning. Join us hey, in Have a the seat, kitchen. Tony. Thank you, bro. All right. So, um, and yeah. Nikki? Nikki, take a seat. Yummy, why, why don't you uh, join me on the set? Oh, you see? This way? Yummy. yummy. Okay. Food yeah. is yummy. What? <laughs> oh, yeah. Food is yummy. So, yummy, yummy. Looks yeah. is mine, essentially. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, need to, I, need to, I need to make sure yummy is as far away from the food as possible. <laughs> I want to serve, I want to serve our guests. Oh, this way. Yes. Come on. Allow the guests to eat. Yes, yes no? ma'am. Eh? Oh, my goodness. Eh? This is looking good. <laughs> yummy, it you're breathing down my neck. <laughs> <laughs> Like, is he going to take us through this process of how he made okay, this? Okay, yeah, one more time. You need to talk about how this was made yeah. so that our guests can, can be okay. sure that you're not going to poison them. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, okay, this is surf and tough pasta. Okay. Yeah. Surf and tough. Uh, yeah, surf and tough. It's surf and tough. It's called surf and tough because it has um, steak and shrimp in it. Okay. So, basically, what we do is um, you, cut your, you cut your beefs into pieces and. Yeah. Um, you cook it with onions and garlic. Mm. After then, you add um, your peppers, tomatoes. What? Cutlery. <laughs> See, your meat, that thing you did just now was very... <laughs> he actually said, where is the and fork? <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand what just happened. So I should go and bring knife and fork for you. Hey! So, like I was saying, you I have nothing to say to you. Oh. Oh. Add your vegetables yeah. wow. and um, mix your Thank pasta, you. your already cooked pasta in it, and um, fine, you're good to go. Mm -hmm. So, before we. Oh, so, hey! Garnishing hey. stuff. Garnishing. No, you're doing well now. You want to swap to pay. Okay, like. Right. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> So, yeah. All right, this is looking good. Mm -hmm. I'm really glad you didn't serve any for your meat, just saying. Right. Um, it is not for you that I serve for myself. So, Nikki, what, what do you think? Any food that has shrimps inside, you got me already. Okay, so have a taste and, that, and yeah, tell us what you think. Okay, what do you think? I love stir fries, so mm -hmm. I'm actually looking forward to seeing what this tastes like. Okay. Uh, <coughs> Tony's looking <coughs> like his wife told him if you try <laughs> <laughs> Tony was my apprentice. Uh, uh, yes, was my yes. sous chef. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let him know. Let him know. All right. Let's That's like the learn work. All right. Why not right. learn work again? So very tasty. Oh, okay. So Tony, what do you think? Hmm? I go bring butter. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you threatening our guests? Hello. We do not promote violence <laughs> on Wake Up Nights. No, we do not. I like. We do not. Pepper is on point. Yeah. So okay. which is actually good. So it's not too pepperish and. Mm. Not soggy at all. You try, you try. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know. It's amazing. It's you amazing. Know. <laughs> always, always. Yes. Beyonce is that chef, yes. Thank you. You know what? I've been a guru also. I love making stir fries a lot, so I'll say very impressive. Well done. <laughs> oh no. Oh, wow, no. wow, 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 wow. It's well Oh. All right, so it's looking like uh, we're going to be rounding off the show yeah. for this week. Honestly. What a week it's been, Titi. It's been powerful. Amazing. It's been inspiring. It's been emotional. We've been trying to summon up that energy that you need at that part of the week where you're like, ah, oh, I don't know if I can keep going. Yeah. But we're going to be back next week. The weekend is here and we have to go now. Of course, we want to say a huge thank you to all our sponsors, uh, Payport eStores for the groceries. Yes, so we also need to thank Homely NG for the kitchen accessories. And finally, for last place for styling my hair. Why do you do that all Did the time? I? I have to now. It's, I have to. It's like, you know, it's not working, is it? All right, uh, thank Louisa, you. To, thank you for the dress. Uh, yeah, beautiful dress. Uh, thank time. you so much, everyone who's been a part of this show. Yeah. And those of you watching at home, thank you for joining us. And again, we'll come back to you on Monday mm -hmm. for breakfast. Don't go too far. We'll be right back. Hey. Titi. It's been powerful. Amazing. It's been inspiring. It's been emotional. We've been trying to summon up that energy that you need 
at that part of the week where you're like, ah, oh, I don't know if I can keep going. Yeah. But we're going to be back next week. The weekend is here and we have to go now. Of course, we want to say a huge thank you to all our sponsors, uh, Payport eStores for the groceries. Yes, so we also need to thank Homely NG for the kitchen accessories. And finally, for last place for styling my hair. Why do you do that all the Did time? I? I have to now. It's, I have to. It's like, you know, it's not working, is it? All right, uh, Louisa, thank you. To, thank you for the dress. Uh, yeah, beautiful dress. Uh, thank you so much, everyone who's been a part of this show. Yeah. And those of you watching at home, thank you for joining us. And again, we'll come back to you on Monday mm -hmm. for breakfast. Don't go too far. We'll be right back. Hey.